What's up, everybody? King of FOMO here, coming at you with your daily crypto update. Make sure you follow me over on Telegram. That's t.me slash King of FOMO1, as well as my TikTok channel listed right there on the screen. All right, so let me preface by saying this. This video is not going to be about anything in particular. No new gems, no new information or anything like that. Just a little bit of a talk about crypto and the space right now and what's going on in the crypto world right now. And uh, I just had to get it off my chest. This is without a doubt, one of the weirdest times in cryptocurrency history is since cryptocurrency has started, and let alone for since when I started back in 2016, nothing like this has really ever happened before. So what am I talking about? I'm talking about the rise of the meme coins. Now, generally, there's always times in crypto where you have fads and you have hundreds of millions of dollars jump into something. Uh, it reminds me of things like Crypto Kitties and the P3D type of games and the lending coins and ICOs. So you have millions of dollars being circulated in crypto all the time in the latest fad. But there's, there's really been nothing to this level of monetary exchange that has happened in cryptocurrency for coins that don't do anything, right? I'm talking about multiple quasi billions of dollars worth record breaking numbers in these meme coins uh, in just a matter of days or weeks. So like we look at some of these coins, like Akita right here, this coin in the past 30 days is up 22,280%. That's, I think that's what, a 2,000x from when you from buying into right there. Dogecoin has had its own crazy run up 18,973% in one year. These are life-changing amounts of money for we're just throwing in a couple of pennies in some of these coins and and these the, all these coins they don't do anything they're just funny coins and you know it makes me think about things like the GameStop rally and and how you know this is sort of what should have happened with GameStop because of uh, the community rallying behind, you know, this coin. The, the problem with the stock market is it's heavily, heavily regulated. So if anything weird or fishy happens, things shut down and then you just can't do anything for a little bit of time. In cryptocurrency, that doesn't happen. It's, you know, it's the wild, wild west out here. You can do whatever you want. You can pump the coin as high as you want and nobody can intervene at all. And that's what's happening with these meme coins like Dogecoin, like Akita, these dog coins really. And even some of the ones that we've been talking about recently, I've talked talked about Safe Mars on the channel, I've talked about Safe Moon on the channel, I've talked about Moon Rat on the channel, and these coins are again going up multiple hundreds or thousand or ten thousand percentages in a matter of weeks. So this is a trade that I made about 77 days ago, I bought three Ethereum worth of Akita tokens. Three Ethereum back at that time was actually even cheaper, so it wasn't $6,000, it was only a couple, maybe, uh, it might have only been a couple hundred dollars 77 days ago, it wasn't that much money. But but today, if I would have held those tokens, if I would have had iron hands and just held everything that I bought, that would have been a $402,000 profit from holding this meme coin from that long. Now, obviously, I'm not sitting back and regretting it because this is an unpredictable thing. Nobody could have ever predicted that this could happen. But again, that is unprecedented levels. And just to kind of put things more into perspective with you guys, most all, all cryptocurrencies have struggled to break $40 billion in market cap. No cryptocurrency has gotten there easily. It's taken a lot of time, a lot of work, a lot of effort for crypto to, for any cryptocurrency to rise close to that level, let alone hold that level for a certain period of time. Dogecoin did it in two weeks. I think within a matter of, it might have even been one week. I think within a matter, no, it was two weeks. Two, within a matter of two weeks, Dogecoin had a increase of 45 Five billion dollars in market cap in that short period of time. So for me, this this is the way that I think about it. I could I could sit here and be upset that I'm missing out on all these pumps, but like I can't convince myself or other people to say, hey, jump in on this coin. It's only up 800% in the past two weeks. It's hard for me to say there's a jump in point for any of this stuff. So a lot of people have been asking me, is it too late to jump in XYZ? I have no idea if it's too late. Like I would have told you it's too late to jump into dogecoin when it went up 10x let alone 80x let alone 800x to where it is right now so uh, just some things that i'm thinking about how long will this last nobody knows time will tell but i think at the end of the day they are meme coins and and, and like 
I don't think that these are going to be the coins that hold up the cryptocurrency market. I do think that there is going to be a, a monumental crash for the majority of these coins. Uh, and that's just the nature of hum human beings. Human beings love to rally behind stuff and watch things grow up super big. But then again, human beings have the nature of having to cash out and uh, ha have fear in their, in their brains as well. So when things start to dump, they will start to dump pretty hardcore. So just do be careful if you're looking for a quick, easy 10x. You might easily get a 10x, 20x, even 100x, but uh, you could also just as easily get a negative 99% uh, from, from where you're buying into some of these coins. I do think that the dumping will eventually happen. Uh, people will just take profits. I mean, people are up. <laughs> it, like, if I was still holding, if I was still holding this coin worth $402,000, I would definitely be taking profit today. I wouldn't be waiting any longer than that. And a lot of other people, I mean, eventually they're going to be thinking the same thing. Uh, and some people are in profit right now and they might be greedy, but once they start seeing that profit going down a little bit, they're going to cash out. So those are just my thoughts. Um, and then a lot of that money will funnel into other areas in crypto. So I think overall it's good, in crypt good for crypto uh, because a lot of, I don't want to say normal people, but a lot of people who don't normally buy crypto, um, see the potential of the crypto market and see how it is free of manipulation and free of control from the parties that be like what happened with GameStop and what happened with a lot of the the, the regulators of the stock market um, you know clamping down on GameStop's growth it, it can't happen with crypto so you know the potential is there for every single other cryptocurrency and I think once this meme craze dies down the crash does happen for a lot of these coins um, you know that's when we're going to have another rally in Bitcoin Ethereum Bitcoin Binance coin XRP Cardano, all these other coins that actually do things as opposed to just, you know, going up for the memes. So those are just my thoughts. What do you guys think about this? Um, do you think... <laughs> I really shouldn't be asking this, but do you guys think that it, it's still a prime time to jump in on the meme coins? Are you still looking for meme coins yourself? Are you jumping in on them? I know I'm looking for a couple just to throw a couple bucks in because, I mean, hey, if it's going to go up 8,000%, I put $100 in, I could get you know $80,000 within a couple of weeks. That's not a bad deal if, if I say so myself. All right, guys, we'll catch you in the next video. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think in the Telegram chat. Peace out.